Yesterday morning I woke up to an email stating that my Twitch account had been indefinitely suspended. After asking, Twitch staff confirmed that it's a permanent ban, but I'm allowed to stream if I make a new account. Almost a decade of history on my favorite streaming platform erased in an instant. All of my followers, subscribers, chat commands, FFZ and BTTV emotes, and everything else, all gone. You may wonder what would be so serious as to cause a permanent ban when I had no previous infractions. My account was made on October 7th, 2012, when I was only 12 years old. Twitch's rules state you can only have an account if you're 13 or older. It's really that simple. Now, why Twitch only thought this was a problem now, almost 10 years later, is beyond me. Currently, I'm 21 years old and about to graduate college with a bachelor's degree, but I'm being punished for a mistake I made when I was quite literally a kid who didn't know better. Why at no point when becoming an affiliate and entering my tax information, or the few times I tried applying for partnership and put myself up for scrutiny, was my account creation date an issue until suddenly on an average May day. I lost a lot of things from this unexpected suspension. All my viewership and community on Twitch that I worked years to build, gone. My revenue for the past month of streaming, vanished as Twitch will likely not pay out. Every VOD has evaporated so I've lost almost all my stream content I was going to edit for YouTube. This has ruined numerous other aspects of my online life so I won't go on forever with minute details. More important to me than anything else is my own personal history from that channel that's now lost. I do have a new channel now, which I can guarantee I was older than 13 when I made. So if you could please follow Willy underscore Osu on Twitch, it would be greatly appreciated. We'll be uh, going for affiliates soon if you'd like to help me stay above the 3 average viewer requirement. Also keep in mind that this may not just affect me, this could just as well be you. Two examples I know are Momo the Melon and Bashiman741, who are in the same boat and saw what happened to me. They created their own new accounts, Momo the Felon and Bashiman742, to be prepared just in case. Instead of ending on a depressing note, although this is a terrible situation, I'm more motivated than ever to rebuild on this new channel and take my stream further than I have before. Thanks for the support.